Last content was live stream on twitch.tv. All right, boys and girls, ladies and gentlemen, we're playing a brand new One Piece game called Sea Piece 2. I ain't gonna lie, just off of the background, I don't, I don't think it's gonna be too hot. But let's get let's get let's get to it. Oh my lord, baby! Woo! Yo, this makes me even better now as a player, bro. My scarf, yo, you, you, chat, live stream. What what should the people on the YouTube channel do, right? First of all, they should mute the in-game music. That's a given. But they gotta go ahead, you know what I'm saying, and get this brand new UGC scarf and all my other UGC items. Uh, some of you guys asked that you wanted the scarf to be in blue. It's gonna be in black soon I, I might just do it by the time this video releases on youtube i don't know it, it, it's, it's, it's gonna be there and we got a yo we got a bunch of drip coming onto the you know our our roblox store with ugc items so stay tuned uh anyway yeah let's check out this brand new game right so we have codes inventory what the hell how do i already have a yuru oh maybe they did it so that if you played the original c piece in c piece 2 you get items all right so then we have stats and then uh that's it Oh, actually, they have a shop. All right, you know what? We'll, we'll go to the shop later into the video, but you can see pretty expensive stuff there. So let's just dive into allocating everything into sword. Because why not? And boom! We now have the Yuru. Yeah. Yo, I see, I see some people saying in the live stream chat that I'm bald. Wow. How about you hop off, kid, huh? I might be bald, but you get no ladies. <laughs> <laughs> so who's really worse off, brother? But anyway, uh, this is the Katana dealer we can buy for 250 why would I want that when I have Yoru? And I think I'm going to be clapping people up. So what is that? Pirate Captain quest at level 20. Uh, level 10 quest over here. So why are they starting me next to these level 10, level 20 quest givers when I'm not even level like two? Oh, level one plus. All right. Talk to me. Yeah, yeah. Five bandits, blah, blah, blah. Bandit beating. So already some people are going to be mad because they're like, oh my God, not another bandit beater. <laughs> but alas, these types of bandit beaters, I don't know. Like they're not too bad like to me because i always felt like these type of bat bandit beaters appeal is that they're kind of like low quality like king legacy block troop type games no disrespect to this game at all but that's the impression that i get when i play them and i think that's why people like them so much all right so we completed the quest two times with level six I i'm already playing these games wrong typically when you play them you want to you know buy double xp right so let's buy that i think this is a game pass and not a boost so bro my dear god why is double belly 1700 robux dog what is that dude what the house we can buy the coffin boat for 100 bobux i'm gonna buy that that's cheap and i don't think this game has boosts to be honest with you oh i mean yeah let's go ahead and buy vip too because we get more more xp and stuff now hopefully uh oh actually is there like an infinite devil fruit notifier because it's telling me where a devil fruit spawn but um that this is the devil fruit. it's the suke fruit somebody dropped it Look, all right. Might as well just eat it. See what's all about, right? So this is a suitcase fruit. We got invisibility. <laughs> it doesn't look like anything. And then they got an invisible punch that didn't really look like anything either. Let me see. Yo, what the hell? I can't see the invisible punch when I use it. <laughs> Get it? I can't see the invisible. All right, never mind. Uh, okay, so um, Mukio in the chat says, go find it. It's not infinite for everybody. Oh, so why the hell do I have uh, a devil fruit notifier? All right, well let's let's, let's go let's go uh, let's go use my 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 coffin boat. No, no, no! Oh my, yo, yo, my boy EQ man, you better not steal, you better not steal my fruit, dude. This, yo, what the hell? This boat is so fast, I'm kind of like lagging out a little bit over here. Yo, somebody just fell off of the. I think one of the noobs in the chat is already here, man. We got to make it quick. Damn, bro. And I barely have any stamina, too, because I, I haven't allocated much of any stat points at all. Dude, the guy that was up here got up here again. He just got... Yo, EQ, didn't I just tell you not to steal it? Oh, this man EQ, man. God damn. All right, this, this is the barrier fruit. It's the barrier. Hey, it's trash. I ain't gonna lie. Yeah, I ain't gonna lie. The barrier fruit is better than what we have, for sure, but it's not nothing great. Oh, he, this man has the chop fruit, bro. Yeah. Okay, so that's my first ability. Uh, It was, it was the barrier weight. Uh, and then we have barrier crash and barrier spike. So let's check out those other two abilities. Let's use the barrier crash first. That looks like that. And actually stuns him for a really good amount of time. Look at that. Oh, maybe he has Pika. This man's asking him how much Robux is that leg? What leg? Are those legs? What the hell? 17K. Yo, this man pays 17,000 Robux for... There's no way, bro. Nah, get out of here. All right, let me, let me, let me check out my last ability, which is barrier spikes. And it looks like that. Um... 
But yeah, the, the chat is saying that that little glow he has on his hands is not him being stunned. It's actually the uh, the Pika fruit. All right. So anyway, um, we have some stat points that we can allocate. Let's just put it on to sort of make things easier for us. All right. So this is our last kill here. And yeah, double XP definitely definitely make things a lot quicker. That's probably why they don't have uh, a boost for double XP because you already have like 2.5 times XP if you get VIP and um and the double boost. I mean double boost, the double XP game pass. Look at that, I'm already level 14, bro. I can just go over here now. Okay, I'm gonna check out my rapid slashes ability because I can use it and I basically do like no damage. And why am I attacking my boy? Okay, well, I just killed off my boy EQ. Bro, I think they have a limit on kills. Yo, EQ, let me kill you again, homie. Bro. Look at that, two out of five daily kills. Maybe they have a limit on kills or maybe, why is this man trying to attack me? Or maybe they have a daily amount of kills for like bounty. Kaka says stat points. Um. Oh yeah, I, I could put in more stat points. Hold on, let me just, yeah, there you go. Level up one more time, brother. What's up, man? How you doing, AP? Yeah, thanks for the bounty, homie. Yo, we gotta kill this guy, bro. I'm not, I'm not, I'm not standing for this slander anymore. Yeah, yeah, you, you're trash. Hop up my turf, kid. All right, cool. So, um, <laughs> yo, let me, let me not start this because then chat is just, oh my God. You see, I started it. Hold on. Put 10 into defense. What the hell? Put 10 into defense. I said, oh, oh my God, bro. I'm trying to like move and then put it in pause and it doesn't work. Pause. <laughs> All right. Look, even, even stronger now, even stronger now, baby. You know what? Yeah. 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 I'm not good enough. My boy I ain't gonna lie to you. All right. We're level 20 now. I mean, this is the thing with these games that I feel like people are tired of because with Bandit Beaters, it, it, uh, I don't know. It, it's gotten boring to the point where you do the same thing on every game and no game does anything different. Like you get the same items. They have the same abilities. It's just like, yeah, like what am I supposed to do? You know? Uh, oh, they have a black market here. So you can buy items for Bow Bucks. I mean, Bow Bucks. Imagine that. Wait. That has to be cash, right? That's there's no way that's Bobux. Cause five thousand for the spin fruit. Let's see how much Bobux. Ah, twenty five. All right, that's cheap. But uh, they have that. Uh, they have daily reward here. Uh, okay. You must be in the group. Hell, no, nah, I ain't joining no group for a reward. You must be crazy. We have a mysterious gentleman. He says, "Would you like to buy a random devil fruit?" No. Okay. So that seems to be all the quest givers and stuff in the starter area. I just dropped man frames there. And bosses seem to take forever to respawn because buggy is still not here, which is probably why in the shop you can buy a, uh, where is it? Yeah. A boss respawn. I ain't going to do that though. No cat. Oh, yo, you know what this game is missing? This game's missing a map. The hell? Literally every game that comes out now has like a dedicated map. So you can see it on your screen. I don't know what level we need to be to get to the next, uh, Island. And what is this man trying to drop us? Oh, the suke fruit. Nah, I don't, want, I don't want suke, man. Oh, by the way, I forgot that I now have enough stamina to use this island splitter ability, which is just going to be our slash thing. Get to the <laughs> That's really what I think of when I use that ability every single time. It looks a little bit different than in most games, but again, this Yoru moveset, it's the same thing. There's nothing, nothing new. Um, again, credit where credit is due because you can't really change up how a move looks if it looks like that in the anime. But I do believe that, I don't know, they could alter the look of it all. I, I, I like the island splitter looks very different. Let me try to use it one more time here. Um, this looks very different from other games, but, um, the Z key, which is the rapid slashes is exactly the same. All right. Anyway, where's the boat spawner? All right, here we go. Let's spawn in our coffin boat, right? We, uh, we finally are level 30. So we're going to try to make it to the next island and we have like 50 million people after us here. So, uh, I think we gotta go to this island. It's probably Jungle Island, the second island in the game. All right, so this is Jungle Island. They call it uh, Jungle. And yeah, our first quest is gonna be level 30. So it's a good thing that I decided to grind out until level 30. Uh, now, let's allocate all our other 60 step. Oh, I am stupid. Uh, all right, whatever. You know what? I'll, I'll keep it like this. At least I won't die in one hit. Whatever. All right, we're level 48. I did this quest a couple of times. I think I should have a good enough amount of stat points here. Yeah, we got 90 stat points. And uh, yeah, let's invest some there. And I mean, I don't really know what to do. Like, th this is the thing with these type of games that when these bandit beating games first came out, they were fun because you were able to like um, watch somebody progress and become a pro uh, from being a noob. 
But now it's kind of like, look, I just killed the boss. Ah, damn it, dude. Dude, I took on the boss quest, but I didn't accept the quest because I had to kill one more gorilla. That, oh my God. But yeah, like the progression just doesn't feel the same anymore in my opinion, right? I'm level 50, so I'm pretty much done with this area, I think. Um, so I don't think it's enticing as a viewer to watch people go through these games, but I could be wrong. I'm not trying to hate on them, but it's just like, bro, like these developers are really making the stigma for bandit beaters worse because they're really not trying. If they weren't trying before, it doesn't seem like they're trying out, chat. Not gonna lie. All right, so we're at a new island over here. I think this might be the next area because the people that we were playing with, bro, what the hell? This is level 100. Oh, they're telling me wrong one now. All right, you know what? You know what? You guys drive the boat, and and, and I I will follow you guys because I don't know where the hell I'm going. There you go. They they drive the boat. All right, we're in Orange Town, baby. Uh, hey, yeah. Okay, let me set my spawn point over here. Okay, guys. So it seems that this is the next area that we need to be at. Uh, Buggy Pirate Quest, level 50, and that's what we gotta do. Now, something else, and I hate to be like a negative Nancy with this game, but we're not really seeing anything on these islands aside from these NPCs. Like what? Like. Where's the Geppo? Where's hockey? Or maybe they have it in the game. It's just not, not here yet. Or I'm not there yet. If that makes sense. Oh. Is this man giving me a kiss? Yo, hey man. Yo, my boy, he came, is my man just yo smutching me up? Give me a little. Not even a little. It was a big smooch. I ain't gonna. Lie. I, I might have liked it, but hey, back off, kid. <laughs> yo, man. We got people here violating me while I'm thanking people for gifting subs, man. Come on now. Oh, so here's here's the trainer. I think this might be the hockey person. Oh, uh, yeah. I mean, hockey. Geppo. 10K. <sighs> I don't even have 10K. I mean, I can buy it with bull bucks, but let me see if I can do the next one. Ah, uh, 75. All right. I'll keep grinding the regular quest, and we'll, we'll get to getting Geppo at least. All right. There we go. We're level 77 now. We can do the next quest, but we have 10K cash. Apparently... Chat is telling me that I have enough cash to get Buso hockey. Um, so I, I, I don't know. I don't know. I want to get Geppo, but I want to get hockey because hockey kind of like how the homie Mars in the chat told me, uh, it would allow us to do more damage. I think that's the smarter choice to, to go with. Who the hell is this guy? Spiritual essence buyer. The hell? Well, I'm going to, I'm going to wait here because Mars says he can take me to where we can get Buso hockey. Cause this is, it's a two part process for the people on the YouTube video. Uh, basically you go to Shellstown, you buy a book and after you buy that book, you have to go to sand Island and, uh, break a hidden wall. And I guess the trainer will be behind that wall and then you can buy it for 10 K. So that's what we're going to do, man. We're going we're gonna to get super swole, baby. We're going to get sturdy. All right. Here's the homeless man. I think he's the one that sells us the book. Uh, let me buy the hockey book. 5 K. There you go. And now let's make our way to sand island okay so here's sand island and this is the secret wall that you break uh, it's already broken but oh actually huh oh it seems you got to use an ability to break it all right so there's uh rayleigh he says or riley whatever you call him i can teach you the basics of buso hockey all right you'll need to give me one hockey book and 10k what the hell that was 10k in total oh, come on man i just wasted my time chat what the hell chat <laughs> Specifically, Mars. Come on, Mars. Yoroichi says we told you. Nah, man. Yeah, y'all said 10k, not 15. Nah, hey, hey, nah, nah, nah. What you mean you said Geppo for 10k, bro? Nah, bro. Look, I'm gonna reset right now. Geppo's gonna be not even. Geppo's 5k, bro. Man, look, man. I know, I, I know, I'm not crazy, or maybe I am. I don't know. Let's see if I'm crazy. Interact, Geppo. Okay. Shoot. <laughs> Wow. Well, uh, this is embarrassing. <laughs> Whoops. I, I, I apologize, chat. My apologies. I, I meant to say you guys were, you know, very much correct and smart. My apologies. All right. You know what? Well, maybe, maybe completing the quest is not going to be too hard because I mean, well, not completing the quest, but getting the money is not going to be too hard. Come here, homie. Yeah. Come here, homie. Yeah. Yeah. Bozo. God damn. Well, we're level 83 and uh we got 2k cash. That's actually not bad. So yeah, it's not gonna take too much time to to get that get pull stuff, but let's keep on. Alright, there you go. We just completed the quest again. And I don't know. I'm not gonna lie to you. I'm kind of tired of this grinding. I really am, chat. Okay, we are now level 92 and we have 11 k So I'm just gonna buy Gepo since we're already here. Uh so yeah, let me buy Gepo. Uh what? Did I just buy it? 
Yeah, I have Gepo. Damn, and it barely uses any set. And they have a limit on the Gepo. Bro, nah, that's it. That's the final straw. Okay, I, I try to give this game a chance, but they have a limit on the freaking Gepo, bro. What the? Bro, come on, man. Come on.